Oh god, I forgot what we were doing. <laughs> oh no. Oh, let's see. That's it. We got the reinforced dive suit and all that good stuff. We have the extra air tank. I remember that. Oh, wait a minute. I wrote notes. I wrote notes like a good person. Uh, let's see. Organize and create storage lockers. No. Make Cyclops go to signal. Oh, that's it. Okay. That's all we're doing. That's not so bad. Good morning, Icicle and Eddard. And Chris Reggie probably will say hello at some point. Make no doubt. Have no doubt. Alright, so we probably are trying to go there. That's probably the signal I was talking about. And then I wanted to make the Cyclops still. And uh, more parts are that way, potentially. Do we upgrade our base's power yet? We haven't done anything since the last stream, so probably not. I did, however, install a map mod. Yay! Obviously, we don't really have any access to anything because we don't, you know, I uh, haven't been anywhere since I started the mod. But hey, it's a, it's a start. So that's the scanner. So that's what's going on there. Okay. I just figured it might be useful to kind of keep things um, a bit more in check since I'm kind of losing my mind trying to find these Cyclops pieces and I keep getting lost and everything else. Let's see how well it works. I haven't actually tested it at all. Just quite literally put it on there. So let's see. If I go here, stare at whatever the heck that is. Remember how to play. What are you? Ah, yes. Useless. Thank you. Uh, left click to enter. Okay. Oh, this thing's breaking. What am I doing? All right, let's see. Oh, okay. That's what it does. Yeah. All right. That's pretty good. I, I can work with that. I can work with that. Cries in console player. Yeah, sorry. <laughs> you, you know, as someone who has very little time and plays pretty much nothing but single player games, being able to mod my games on the PC is a godsend. It just makes it so that I can play my games the exact way I want. Obviously, it's not hurting anybody, so, like, you know, there's no moral quandaries about me modding my games since they're probably, like, 99% all single player. And, uh, yeah. It's just really nice. Let's me... Let's me take a little of the edge off sometimes. It's nice. Wouldn't, it could never go back. Could never go back to console. Also, I just like the control with the uh, mouse and keyboard. It just feels feels better. Something you could do is drop beacons everywhere. You could. That is that is the method that they would expect you to do. Like you know, base game. However, I can now just open this map. Where's that? Oh look, the show's Rex. Um, I can just open this map, and if I remember correctly, there's a button I can push to actually make a beacon. I forget what it is though, so <laughs> so maybe maybe we can't do that. Maybe I will still need to make beacons. But uh, yeah, let's let's go see what that is though. There's a wreck. Oh, that's just that's the one I hovered over. That's not the same thing. I was hoping that would be like the uh, Cyclops pieces, but unfortunately no, no. That we still have to do that. I don't remember what it is we're looking for in the Cyclops, but I'm pretty sure it's not the waffles. It is not the waffles. Okay. So, still looking. I've met Reggie's mom. You know, it makes sense that Reggie would have a mom, but no. No, and considering how fun Reggie is, I'm not super keen on it. I mean, we've got the laser gun, so, like, we'll probably be okay, but still not keen. Still not super excited about that. Piloting the Cyclops on controller is not always so great. Yeah, we don't. We should hopefully not have that problem. Hopefully that is not a problem on uh, mouse and keyboard. <laughs> All right, let's check out down here. 
Oh, we only have 21 energy left in this thing? Damn. Where are these again? Uh, uh, hi. I remember you. There's more of you, huh? Okay, that's right. I remember now. <laughs> Run away. I remember now. It's where did it go? And is there something important down there? I feel there it is. I feel like there should be something down there if it's being protected by uh, fucking what was that teenage mutant ninja turtle bad guy with the brain in his stomach? <laughs> we'll just call them Metroids. It's it's being guarded by Metroids, so surely there's something good down there. Reggie's mom has got it going on. Ooh. Another Metroid. Krang! Yeah, it was Krang. That's who it was. Yeah, we're relatively safe here. I'm not too concerned. Oh, wrong button. Try again. Come on, Lemon. What other mods do we have besides the map? We only have the map and an inventory booster. Um, simply because I do not like to go back and forth, back and forth, back and forth. So it was just easier to, uh, boost my inventory and call it a day. Where are we going here? Out into the deep blue sea. Let's do that during the day. Hmm. Yeah, let's not go that way. I am not. I am not certain. In fact, I am less certain now that you say that. So we're not going to do that. We're going to go this way. What I would do for a Cyclops, but I think, considering we've been searching for this piece for like the last two hours of game time, it's probably for the best if we just move on. We accept the loss and just kind of move forward. Unless... was not what we needed. Damn. <laughs> I live in hope, but, you know. Listen to this while your family drives to see the total solar eclipse? Yeah, we're going to do that today, too. We're going to do that today, too. It only happens, like, once every 20 years. you got to check it out at least once, right? Got to check it out. And I am receiving a phone call that might be important. One second. Okay, and we're back. Alright. As long as it doesn't hit Earth, I'm good. My guy, that's not how so that's not how solar eclipses work. <laughs> that's You didn't do well in science, did you? No, I'm just kidding. 
Uh, yeah, solar eclipse is when the rotations of the planet and the moon and the sun work in such a way that the moon will block out the sun's rays for a few minutes. Technically for a few hours, but fully only for like a few minutes. Oh, he's talking about the comet? Oh, okay, okay, okay. Well, that's what I get for not paying attention. Um... Yeah, no, if a comet could just, like, not hit the Earth, that'd be cool. I'm, I'm with you on that one. Right, let's see. What am I looking here? Moon pool? Moon pool? Now, hang on a minute. Why the heck are you giving me moon pools all of a sudden? Welcome aboard, Captain. What nonsense is this? Guys, I'm gonna be honest, I don't even remember what we're looking for. I know we're looking for a Cyclops piece, but I don't remember, like... Is the sausage one? Is the way I described it, because we were hungry last time we were looking at everything. So we found the waffles, but we haven't found the sausage. You're not waffles at all, are you? You are waffles. You're not sausage, that's what I meant. Is something glowing red behind me? Oh, it's the mushrooms. Oh, okay. How much have I done so far? Uh, probably more than I thought, but less than I'd like would probably be the most accurate way to <laughs> describe that. What is that thing? Bridge fragment. Is this the one I need? No. Why would it be? Yes, yeah, so if anyone sees the Cyclops sausage looking part, let me know. Let me know if you see it and I miss it, because I would like it to be done. I think I only need, like, one more, too, so it's, it's driving me nuts. Mm -mm. Your principal pulled everyone out of class to come see it? Oh, good, yes. You know, it's one of those things where, like, you don't get to see it very often. Like I said, like, probably, I think that the idea is like it's once every 20 years or so for like this kind of level of it. So, yeah, good on your principal for getting everybody out there. Like, all right, go look at it. <laughs> you might not think it's important, but it's important. Go look at it. All right, we're running low on energy, so I'm going to head on back to base before I regret my actions here. And, uh, we'll charge this up in the moon bay, and then uh, we'll kind of plan a form of attack from there. What are people's favorite type of waffles? There's more than one type of waffle? I mean, I guess I guess that's true if you're putting things in the waffle, but it's... I mean, a waffle's a waffle, man. <laughs> it's either a waffle or you sprinkled some blueberries or something into the waffle mix. I'm a fan of just plain old waffles myself. No reason to mess with uh, a good thing. Look around the floating island wreck. We, you were going to have to point me in the direction of that one, but I am totally on board. You're just going to have to point me in the right direction, that's all. But now we have a map, so it should be relatively easy. Check around the Aurora. I think we did that already. I've checked. I swear I've checked around the Aurora, and I swear now we've checked around both of the mushroom forests. So, running out of options here. The engineering fragments are the only ones not in the mushroom forest. Oh, fantastic. And yet I found some. Don't ask me how or why. It's next to the mountain. Okay. So I, I've been there before. I just don't remember how to get there. So, yeah, we'll just have to look at the map real quick and figure it all out. Welcome aboard, Captain. Streamer luck? Yeah, that must be it. All right, we're going to let that do its thing. Whoop. Let's go back to base. Keep Welcome calm. Alright, well, our batteries are looking good. We'll just take those. Let's 
put all our titanium away. Not that one. This one. Oh, this lovely titanium. So much. I don't know where lithium, where I put that, but it's in one of these somewhere. Hmm. Here it is. Boop. All right. So what have I got going on here? We've got a bunch of batteries. We've got the propulsion cannon, the rifle, laser cutter, repair tool. We're doing good on everything else. Everything else is fine. Running a little low on this fire extinguisher. But I think I put a bunch in here. No, that's my posters. I know I had. There we go. Let's swap you out with a full canister. Just in case. All right. Let's see. You think there was one fragment inside the Aurora cargo hold, but the island where you got the diamonds is a good spot, too. Okay. So, let's see what I'm looking at here. This is Life Pot 12, Life Pot 3. That's the Degasi habitat that we need to go explore. This is what? The base I've been building? Yeah. And that's the jellyfish fields. Okay, so, you can open the biome tab on the map. Can I? Oh, would you look at that? Interesting. Mushroom forest, dunes, blood kelp, grassy plateaus, kelp forest, safe shallows, etc. Cool. Um, it's a shame that this didn't start from where we... <laughs> it's a shame I didn't have this when I started. That would have been helpful because then this map would have been a lot more filled out. But uh, such is life. Okay. So you guys are saying it's in the top left over here by the dunes and the mushroom forest where we were by Life Part 13. And there's a, a fragment in the Aurora. Okay. To the right of the blue area. Okay. So underwater islands. Oh, look at that. Yeah, there it is. Wait, it actually tells me even though I... I'm like hovering over the the void and it's still telling me what the biomes are. Interesting. Well, okay. That makes things a little easier. Thank you, chat. Appreciate that. How's this looking? Can I analyze this without getting in it? Um, 81. Energy charging 54%. That's more than enough. That's plenty fine. That works really well. I like that. Alright, so we are going to go that way. North to northwest. Let's go. Can you set markers with the map mod? I think so. I just can't remember the controls. <laughs> so, the answer is probably. But Lemon is bad at games. And installed this map, or, um, yeah, this map mod probably uh, a week or two ago. <laughs> we here at the Backlogs know everything with certainty, and we can answer that question with a very probable maybe. Alright. Yes, we'll head to the underwater islands, we'll check that out, see what's going on there. See what's going on there. When will we get a new episode of the Sour Hour? Hmm. That's a good question. That's a good question. We know what the next episode is going to be, but we just we're all so busy. We're all so busy, we just haven't had a whole moment to do it. So I'm guessing it's below the floating islands, not on the floating islands. That would be my guess. Hey, big guy. Let's see, this thing can go to 300 meters. So let's help stabilize here. Not super keen on going deeper. Don't really like to do that. It's on a wreck on an island. On one of these islands? These are... Unless is this is this the island? I can't remember. I 
or is this just an uh, underwater shelf? Erosion patterns on the land masses suspended here suggest they once floated on the surface. Uh huh. Whee! Just getting my bearings here. Alright, so let's see. Going to this. Probably a bit more this way. Do we know when the next upload's gonna be? Um, no, unfortunately we don't. I am only just coming out of my ickness, my illness, ickness, both, whatever. As you can tell, I'm still kind of fumbling with my tongue. Um, brain's not working 100% just yet. So yeah, I'm, today is like the first day I actually feel well enough to, s to talk for an extended period of time. Um, and also form semi-coherent thoughts. So we're not exactly done with the script for the next video just yet. Um, mainly due to the fact that I just wasn't able to put my brain together. So it'll come out either sometime this week or this weekend. One of the two. Right, what am I looking at here? This is just like a blank space on the map. What is? Oh, look at that. Hold that thought. That looks like a piece I need. Yeah, that'll do. Ah, I needed two. Okay, good. And we're done. That was easy. Map. For this, the map was helpful. The map was very helpful. Also, wait, there's some stuff there. Get, get out of here, you. Honestly. Creature decoy. Oh. That could be useful. Is there a way in here? Is this the kind of thing where we can get in it? Because if so... Ah, yes it is. In that case, don't mind me. Give me a second. We're already here. We might as well check it out, right? Uh, yeah, we'll take those. We take those. This is not actually oxygen. Okay. Prawn suit propulsion arm fragment. Interesting. Interesting choice. Interesting choice. Uh, door opens. Yes, it does. We should be resting. I have been resting for the past week. Don't, don't, don't get me wrong. I have taken a week-long sick vacation, and uh, feeling a lot better. I played a lot of Baldur's Gate three. <laughs> feeling real good about it. Um, but yeah, no, we've, I've done my resting. It's it's time to get back on the wheel here. The oxygen level, oxygen levels are fine. Let's see, anything else going on in here? Another one? There, we go. there are two more data boxes in the wreck. Mm. Alright. Well, we got two air tanks, so we're gonna be fine. We're just gonna get exploring. Power cell charger. Hey, now we're talking. Would love to have one more of those, for sure. Anything else up here? Looks like no. Looks like no. Sealed door. I got a thing for that. Let's see. Laser cutter. Did we get to the third act? Yeah, uh, oh, you mean for Baldur's Gate? No. No, I'm not even through the first. I have been taking my time. Uh, I had to, I reset my character probably. Oh, about six times, I'd say. Um, yeah, about I had about six hard resets just because I wasn't happy with the character. Fire suppression system. That seems important. And a grappling arm. 
Did I need a new mods and slash stream? Uh, a map mod. Yeah, so now I can actually see things. P-R-A-W-N safety instructions appendix A-14. Oh, Brian. Don't climb on or get off equipment while it's moving. Yeah, so it took me a bit to get into Baldur's Gate 3. I had to find the right class and find the right mentality for it. But once I did, it has been very satisfying. It is... It has finally become the puzzle game that I wanted it to be. And, uh, I'm happy with it. I came through that door. can go through that door. Don't panic about the oxygen, everybody. Don't worry. I have another air tank. It's fine. Fighter goes burr. Fighter does go burr. Fighter does go burr. You know what's also fun, though? Being a wizard who is only interested in a book club. <laughs> I made a wizard who, for all intents and purposes, only has, like, ritual spells. Swim, charge, fins. Interesting. What the heck is that? Put this up, please. No, don't drop it, you fool. Put it on. There we go. I had a little less oxygen than I wanted it to, so hold on a minute. Let's. That's more than enough to get out of here, but let's get out of here. And recharge all our oxygen. Yeah, so I've been playing multiple classes. Um, one to make sure, because Kat's been playing too, so if ever we play together, I wanted to make sure that she had the class that she needed for support. Where is my... Oh, this stupid thing. I always lose track of it. It should be right by the door. Where is it? Did you guys break it? Oh, don't tell me they broke it. Oh, I think they might have broke it. Oh, no. Yeah, I think the bone sharks broke my Seamoth. Oh, shit. Well, that's unfortunate. Does the map show you all ears from the get-go? No, it reveals it gradually as you explore. Alright, let's recharge all these oxygen tanks. <sighs> we'll finish up the wreck. We're gonna have to go back and make another Seamoth. That's kind of... That's unfortunate. That's a real bummer. Yeah, I, th I think I left the lights on, and I think they, as people are saying, are attracted to lights, so I think they blew it up. Cool! So cool. That's great. Um, anyway, it's fine. It's fine. We'll be alright. Keep calm, like the kitty says. Uh, but yeah, so I've been making multiple characters just to kind of play around with it. That way, if Cat does need a particular... Uh, assistant I could jump in but the most fun I've had so far has been the fighter the paladin the warlock okay they're all fun um grappling arm nice uh but a lot of fun was being a wizard who was only interested in collecting all the books around and all the scrolls because when you are a wizard and you have scrolls you can learn any spell that is written down so my wizard has just been collecting every spell in the game it's been a hoot. This... Okay. Yep, that is... That is exactly how that worked. Drill suit arm fragment. Ooh, yes. We do need those. Alright. Maybe there's a couple more prawn pieces around. Could you get out of here? Haven't you done enough? Hmm. Oop, saw something. No, there's just this. You can move that door on the floor blocking the ladder. Can you? Door on the floor blocking the ladder. Which one are we talking here? Is it? Which one are you talking about, chat? I'm gonna need to go back up for more oxygen to get our tie. Mm-hmm. 
Yeah. Okay, so I missed it again. Something. Oops. Oh, oh, getting stuck. In the room you just left outside. Okay, yeah, there, so give me a second. Give me a second. Let me get situated here. Only quitters need oxygen. That's right. Oh, this thing right here. Oh, I see. So if I do this, and I do this, just put it over there. Oh, look at that. Get down there. Please? Thank you. 30 seconds. Yeah, but I found alien containment, though. <laughs> alright, alright. Uh, yep, we'll take that. Take that. Don't need that. Anything else? Oh, power cell. Yes. There we go. Alright. We didn't find all the cool things, but we found a good chunk of them. I'm, I'm okay with this. But it is time to leave. Good call on that one, chat. Alright. Which direction do I need to go here? Um, that one. This way and up. We're we just fine. Thanks, Chris. Have a good one. I can craft the depth model MK1 so I did, didn't soft lock myself. Oh, yeah, that's right. We did lose that, didn't we? That's a bit of a bummer. Let's see, put this on too. Never occurred to you that you should maybe use multiple oxygen tanks? Uh, it didn't occur to me naturally. That just kind of happened on accident. What are my thoughts on this game? It's interesting. Um, I like the atmosphere. It's very good. I do wish... I understand why they don't do it, but I do wish that the... Uh, render distance above water was better. I know they did it on purpose so you wouldn't just head straight for land. For story purposes, but I still wish you could turn that off. Um, yeah. But no, it's uh, it's been a fun game. I, I, it's an interesting choice so that like, you can't actually fight the underwater monsters <laughs> everywhere or animals if you're a bleeding heart. Um, I do have like the laser gun, so I can like stun them. But uh, yeah, it's just an interesting choice. So it's been good. It's been good. Uh, I'm glad I've been playing it. I'm glad I've been playing it. It's been helping a lot with my underwater fear. So, you know. Multiple wins here. Okay. We've made it home. We need to make a new sea moth. Which means we're actually going to need to go to our Neptune. Because that's where my freaking mobile platform is, I think. It's dagger gameplay, Lemon. Is it, though? Is it, though? To be fair, the tanks take up a lot of space. That's true. Yeah, I am in the unique situation where it doesn't bother me to have extra space. But, uh... Yeah, that's true enough. Alright, let's see here. Well, we could... Make another sea moth. It'd be easy enough. Or we could try to make this. Plasteel, enable glass, lubricant, advanced wiring kit. Oh god, okay. It's gonna be even This is gonna be a minute. Let's see. I need Scroll this bad boy down here. Hmm. Epic mech suit. Yeah, okay. Uh where is it? So swim charge What is this? Wirelessly charge your handheld tool while you swim. Oh, that is cool. Yeah, I want that. Um, I think this is the one I already have. I'd be cool with swapping between those, though. Does this do more damage? Out of curiosity. I don't think... It probably doesn't. 
Probably doesn't. We don't. We haven't reached the depth module for the Cyclops yet. I might be able to make this. Uh, what else we got going on here? Cyclops. I want that. Engine efficiency. Okay. Sonar upgrade. Sounds important. Fire suppression system. Now we don't need one of those. Um. Hmm. 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 Things are getting. Things are getting complicated over here. Right. <laughs> Let's see what we can and can't make. Thermal blade does more damage. I know it grills the fish. Does more damage though, huh? Well then. Yeah, I'm aware that the charge fins are going to be slower than the ultra glides. Yeah, um, but that's okay because then we just swap between them, right? You just gotta swap between them. It's easy as that. Welcome aboard, Captain. This is the mod station. Swim charge fans. There it is. Thermal blade. Fuck it. Go for it. If I'm gonna have a sword, I might as well have a flame sword. All right, that's done. Now let's see here. I'm gonna need a lot of magnetite and other nonsense. Oh boy. Which I swear I grabbed a bunch of it. It's around here somewhere. There we go. Yeah, we got plenty of that riding around, so that's fine. Oops, what was this? Oh, the energy efficiency module. Oh, great. Good news, everyone. We can get rid of that one. Where is it? Yeah, get that out of here. All right, one less thing to worry about. Okay, I need a computer chip for the propulsion gun. Computer chip. Table coral, gold, and copper wire. Well, here's the gold. Here's the copper wire. Table coral, though, I might... Nope, I do. Copper wire. Computer chip. All right. Now, the better question, though, is do we want the sonar thing? Scans the train outside the displays a 3D map in the cockpit. That could be very useful. Um, let's see. Or do we save it for this repulsion gun? I feel like we're not really going to use that. It's cool and all. But I think I'd rather have the yeah, sonar upgrade, which will be somewhere else. So let's not worry about that for now. I'm going to leave it on my screen so I don't forget about it. I took that one off. Let's see. Uh, what else we got going on here? Um, I need a wiring kit and whatever the green thing is. That's this one, right? Hydrochloric acid and gold. Well, I can make that. Hold on a minute. That's acid mushrooms. Deep mushrooms. I think it said we needed three. What else? And a salt deposit. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I've got those. Where are those at? Where are those at? Ooh. Let's take one of those. Alright. So hydrochloric acid. Okay, and now I need some gold. Boop. Okay. Got that. And then I need to make a wiring kit, which is the silver. Oh, I hate that one. Oh, just enough. Okay. We combine that with, uh, not the ultra glide fins, I just need some regular old fins. What do those require? Silicon rubber? <laughs> uh, I might have some of that. Maybe I don't. Yeah. What do I keep getting stuck on? Oh, my bed. Oh, wait a minute. 
They have one. Hmm. Yeah. Please hold. Let's see where. There it is. This <laughs> acid metal. Jeez. Jeez. All right. Where is my knife? Knife. Uh, I think that's how we get the rubber, right? That feels right. That feels right. Flames are underwater? Oh, hell yeah. Let's see. Um, here. Oop, don't do that. <laughs> that makes fiber mesh. Damn it. Alright, well, let's make it anyway. My bad. Did it wrong. To be fair, to be honest, if you have one battery charger and a lot of batteries to cycle, you don't need the charge bins. It's true, but also I don't have to come back to base if I can just charge them while I'm swimming. The less times I have to come back to base, the better. That is the play. That is the play. Let's grab a couple of these. Make so I never have to do this again. There we go. How many did I grab? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 15, 16. Good. I just wanted to be sure I had an even number. Do I happen to be a DM? Yes. That I do. Say one for a grove bed. Uh, we don't need food or water, my friend. Oh, you'll have infinite supply when you plant them. Oh, I see. That's okay. They're they're literally right outside the base. I'm not worried about it. Something else maybe, but not these. The fire suppressor gonna take a while because we have to go to the deep parts of the game. Oh yay. Well, maybe we'll take that one off then. <laughs> I think I saw somebody ask me if I played any musical instruments. Um, yeah. Yeah, quite a few. Uh, I play piano and saxophone and xylophone. Let's get some lubricant here. And get guitar, not so much, but bass guitar. Uh, and I'm pretty sure I could probably play anything else you give me. If you give me a week to practice it. All right, let's see here. First off, I want my gun back as number one there. What was I working on here? Well, power cell's important. We do want that. But I was trying to make the fins. I played the lube. <laughs> no, 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 no. Context, context. All right, what is this? Oh, the creature decoy. Ugh, wiring kits. Nope. Nope, we'll be making those anytime soon. Alright, uh, swim charge fans. Yes, please. And just like that, he no longer needs batteries. Well, not really, anyway. Cool. Glad to have those. Is this where I've been jamming these? No. Let's put them here. These go here. Hmm... A good number of those there, and then the rest of them can go here. Yep, we need that. Um, titanium will go in here too. Or not titanium, magnetite, or whatever it's held. Alright, anyway. So, blueprints. Get that out of here. Chat says fire suppression system is not going to happen. Alright. So now it's just time for Cyclops. Uh, Cyclops requires some stuff. We have the lubricant we need. Plasteel. We can do that. 
Let's see, we're going to need titanium, which is no problem. And then the plasteel requires lithium, which should also be no problem. Let's see. Let's see. Let's grab a bunch of titanium, because we need a lot of it. Okay. Nope. Nope. Lithium. A couple pieces there. Alright. Titanium ingot. We're gonna need three of these. I do believe. Yeah. Charge vents are so good for the lazy style of man? That'd be me. <laughs> or efficient. <laughs> it's efficient, because I don't have to go back. That's the way it goes. Oh, he plays the fiddle and the cello? Hey, that's a good one. That's hard to do. Can't play me any kind of that string instrument. And one more of these. Once you learn music, all instruments are the same. Kind of. Um, it, it was very helpful that I played piano first. Need lead. Um, simply because then I had to read both the bass and treble clef. So that was super helpful. Because then it was no longer an issue to read any of the music. But certain instruments take a little bit of finagling to figure it out. But other ones are very much translate, like translate over for sure. Like if I, since I play saxophone, I could probably play clarinet with minimal practice. Flute would be a little harder. Trumpet would definitely be harder because it's just a different method of playing. But uh, yeah, for sure it could be done. Oh, I had some of this already. Eh, well, what are you going to do? Um, what am I looking for? I'm looking for the lead. Get the lead out, Lemon. Where's the lead? Stupid bed. There it is. How much did I need? The three? Cool. Alright. What else do we need? We need an advanced wiring kit. Which requires a wiring kit. And gold. Okay. Did I make this already? No, I haven't made this. So I need to make another microchip as well. Okay. Okay. Or a computer chip, rather. So we're going to need silver, two silver, we're going to need some copper, oh, it's going to be a whole thing, okay, cool, and this thing, stalker tooth and glass, that's it, and I need three of them, oh, I think I only have one stalker tooth, yeah, I've only got one, but we know how to get it, so it's going to be relatively okay. Lubricant in there. I'll put the magnetite away for now. Uh, I'm not going to need any of these batteries anymore. Let's put that away. Oh, these first aid kits. Uh, let's put some of them away. Hold on to that, of course. Keep that for now. All right. I guess I do need three of those magnetites. I'll take three. One, two, three. Alright. And I think I've got a bunch of glass somewhere. Where did I see it? I know I have it. Was it the other side? Yes, the other side. Uh, there's the three glass I need. Wait, how much... How does this work? Enameled glass? Oh, it's just one. Okay, good. So yeah, so I'll have the three I need there, but we need two more stalker teeth. It's night time. Go back to bed. Kakiro! Lemon and Subnautica, what a way to start the week. It's exactly what you need to calm down after you brought democracy to the automaton front over the weekend. Hey, congratulations, by the way. No more robots. Can you believe it? What a time to be alive. <laughs> what a time to be alive. All right. Thank you so much, by the way. Oh, what are we doing here? You play Barry Sax? Ooh, the best sax. Yes. Barry Sax is best sax. Well, let's keep going here. Uh, we need some stalker teeth, and there's a stalker. What I really need is I need a piece of salvage. 
Those alerts are still off, aren't they? Hold on a minute. Boop. All right, the alerts are back on. I apologize. I know the I know the uh, the horn still played, which is all anyone really cares about. But um, there, now it'll actually pop up on screen next time. My bad, my bad, my bad. All right, let's see. What am I doing? Since I need salvage, there's not gonna be any salvage in here. Lemon, what are you doing? I guess I needed one battery just because this thing... Well, no, actually, we don't need to do that at all. Because if I do... Let's test this out. I'm curious. If I put these on... Eh, it's a little slow, the charge. Yeah, it's a tad slow. But I guess it's one of those things, like, if you're not doing anything anyway, you're just kind of wandering around anyhow, it's not so bad. Hmm. All right, salvage, salvage. Surely I didn't take all the salvage from around here, did I? Surely there's something. Hmm, maybe I did. Okay, well, I do wish that the... There's some. I do wish that these were a little bit better, but uh, it's fine. It's fine. I can pick this up. Oh, I see. And then we're just going to drop it in front of them, essentially. Well, hey, that seems doable. Just come over to here, because they like to hang out over here. Just use the scanner room for teeth. We could... But where's the fun in that? Look, there's one right there. Look how friendly he looks. Alright, let's see. Put this in my hand. I don't quite remember how to drop it. It's probably going to be right click. We're going to find out. I'll put on my better fins. Hi! Hello! Would you like this? May I offer you a piece of str uh, whatever this is in these trying times? No? <laughs> Are you sure? I seasoned this one to perfection. There you go. That's the spirit. Bye bye now. He did not drop a piece. <laughs> he, he did not immediately drop a tooth like I was hoping. <laughs> Damn. But if I follow you, maybe then? This isn't going to work like I wanted to, is it? Now they're fighting over it. Oh, God. Ah, oh, jeez. Okay. Well, take some copper while I'm out here. Yeah, all right. We're going to do the scanner thing. Yeah, yeah. Oxygen. I know, I know. Whew. Why must I only stream this while you're busy? Uh, because I only stream it during the week. That's probably why. Uh, scanner room is over here. Welcome aboard, Captain. Hello, you. I need those. Make it happen. Is one wearing a record hat? <laughs> well, maybe. There we go. I only need three. Two, I guess. Three would be nice. Yoink. And yoink. And give me one or two more just to refill my coffers, and we'll be good to go. Okay. 
That is good enough. Um, okay, so that'll get the glass out of the way. Now we still need silver. But the scan room will help with that problem too. I hope. Alright, that's plenty. Let's get out of here. So how many of these underwater stations can you make? Uh, as many as you have the materials for, I imagine. So that's kind of dependent on how, how much you collect. Okay. Stop scanning, please. Um, silver comes from sandstone, I do believe. Let me double check that theory. Yeah, because that's limestone. Sandstone, please. Alright. And while that's thinking about that for a minute. Welcome aboard, Captain. Yeah, yeah. Make me some enameled glass, please. Alright. That's all that. I do need that one lubricant that I neglected to keep. There we are. And then this wiring kit. Oh, we need two silver to get the first one. And then we need two gold, which I can do. But I also need another computer chip, which is going to require copper and table coral. So let's grab that while we're out and about. Let's see. Um, knife. I think I only need two. We're going to take four, just so I don't need it later. You know what? Screw it. Let's go for six. There we go. Why not? Go crazy. Go crazy with the cheese whiz. Gun. Gun. Alright, so, sandstone. That's gold. Not quite what I needed. Alright, that's lead. Not quite what we needed. There's one. Grab that on principle. Nope. There it is. There's the silver we needed. Alright. I needed some more copper. Probably. But I don't want to put that in the scanner because the, the entire screen is just going to light up. That'll be a problem. Hmm. Though actually with as much as I've been clearing this area, maybe we should. Alright, 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 alright. Keep moving. Just keep moving. <laughs> there was a guy who beat the game by just putting tubes everywhere? Jesus. That guy must have really not wanted to be in the water, huh? Understandable. Can relate. Can relate. I can understand. Don't think I'd have the patience to do that, but, you know, teach their own. There's the limestone, okay, right. Not that one. Try again. Still more tight, Knight. Don't need that. There's some copper, and that should be enough. But... There we go. Now it's definitely enough. But... I mean, we're already out here. Let's make sure we've got enough for later. I am a little turned around. There we go. 
Man, when it gets dark, it gets dark. Spooky. Alright, good enough. Good enough. So. Step one. Wiring kit. Step two. Copper wire for later. Computer chip for later. Alright. Now I need this advanced wiring kit. It requires two gold. That's why it wasn't working. Boop, boop. And advanced wiring kit. Ladies and gentlemen, that's a Cyclops. We gotta turn that scanner off, good god. Build a Cyclops in deep water, it's big. Uh, I think our thing, our mobile unit creator, whatever, station is in deep water. We should be okay. We should be okay. Alright, so a few things, real quick. Welcome aboard, Captain. Yes, thank you. I turn that off. Uh, fucking find, like... I wish you could just turn this off and, like, not have it go anymore. Or can you? Uh, you can. What am I doing? You need to leave it alone. It's fine. Lemon, don't mess with it. Alright, so that's all taken care of. We Welcome need... Aboard, need to empty my pockets a little bit. See, that's gold. I don't have any extra of that. I can put these in here, though. And the stalker tooth I got lying around. That's fine. Uh, all this titanium I do not need. So let's put that away. Okay, we need the rest of that. Mm, this copper I don't need as well. Do I have any copper lying around? I don't think think so, so we're going to put it here. I need the lead, right? I do need the lead. I don't need that much lead, but I do need lead. Okay. And last but not least, uh, let's take four batteries. Just because. Whoa. If you could put that in there, that'd be great. Okay. In fact, let's just fully charge up here. This one's fine. Alright. And we'll just pump those in there. So we're good to go. Cool. Alright. Where is my creation station? Yeehaw. Time to go meet Ghost Leviathans. Ha ha! You mean the fucking Metroids? We've seen those already. We have a bed now? We do! Yes. When chat told me that we could skip the night time with a bed, I immediately made one. Alright. When you build it, make sure you're not looking in the direction of the launch platform. Cyclops might fall on it. Oh! Well, let's not do that. That sounds like a bad time. I don't want to climb it. I want to pick it up. And then I want to put it... Let's go here. Here's good. Yeah! Okay. Alright. Moment of truth. Make the thing. Achievement. Oh, that is very large. Yeah, that would have definitely landed on the vehicle platform. Huh. Yeah, I'm not whatever qualification she said I needed to be. It's gonna be fine. Look at that monstrosity, though. My god. Woo! Hello. I'm your father. How do I get in you? <laughs> How? That don't take that out of context. How? Oh, okay, right here. <coughs> oh, sip your pee. All systems online. 
Okay. All right. Wow, this is an actual full-on ship, huh? Oh boy. Man, I climbed the ladders fast. Uh, toggle the external floodlights. Oh, that's internal. Oh, this is gonna be a whole thing. Uh, okay. Oh boy. Modification station. Oh, we can change the color. Yes. Yes. Stripe one. Where is... There we go. Stripe two. Also that. Name. Oh, we gotta name it. Damn it. Okay. There it is. That'll work. Boop. Alright. That was fun. Uh, is there anything else I can do? I wanted to actually add mods to this, not just pretend. How do I... What is this? Oh boy, what is all this? Pilot sub. I would love to, but hold on a minute. Thank God they gave me a fire extinguisher. Oh, this is a whole thing, chat. I was not ready for this. Um, you can dock a vehicle here? What? This comes with a mobile moon bay? Oh. Oh, a decoy launcher. Oh. Whoa. Oh. <laughs> oh, boy. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, God. No, oh, this is a lot. <laughs> I was not ready for this. God. Well, now I understand why there's a multiplayer mod. Jesus. The hologram is to show you where the damage is on the ship. Got it. This is the fabricator for the mods, like this thing that I want. So let's go make that. That's good. Thank you. Decoy tube upgrade increases capacity. Interesting. Shield generator. Ooh, I wish. Ooh. Oh, I can make that. And the death module, unfortunately, we cannot access at this current time. Okay, all right, all right. Glad they have more fire extinguishers. Oh, here's the upgrades. Okay. Let's see. So, sonar. Good. Oh, I already have the energy efficiency. What am I doing? Why do I keep doing that? Why do I keep doing that? Get this off here. Get that out of there. There we go. Look at this bad boy. Look at this guy. Now we just need to make a sea moth. Because <laughs> I didn't realize I could put one in here. That's freaking cool. Where is the sea moth? Moon pool, yes. Sea moth, no. Where is sea moth? I know you're here. There you are. Oh, we can make all that. That's no problem. Alright. That's pretty cool. Hmm. So. Uh huh. Activate sonar. Oh. Interesting. Why would we do that? Uh, rig for silent running. Activate external camera system. What is all this? Oh my god. And there's multiple cameras? Jesus. That's something else. Silent running, obviously, is to be a little quieter. That makes sense. It probably takes a little more energy. Ah! There's a horn. Okay. So how do I go? I would like to go forward, please. Oh, engine's offline. Excuse me. Oh. Okay. Well, then. Uh, let's go. Head slow. <laughs> how? Where am... Let me... Exit, so I know where I'm going here. Where am I facing? The wrong direction? Fantastic, let's go. This is gonna be a whole thing, guys. Um. Hmm. Interesting. Ahoy! I have a feeling my life pod is a little area is a little too small for this, so we're not gonna go all the way. But we're gonna get a little closer. 
How do I go down? Spaces to go up. How do you go down, though? That's what I want to know. Because I can't just angle it downward like I can with the Seamoth, so... C. Oh, thank you. What's it saying? Are we taking damage? From what, the fish or something? There. Right. This will work. New question. How do I get out of it? There we go. Alright. Whoa. Hey, look at that. That is an eyesore if I've ever seen one. Hell yeah, alright. <laughs> That's what we like to see. That's something else. I was just warning and telling you you're close to crashing. Thank you. I was wondering what that was. Alright, so let's see. I need a sea moth. A sea moth would require. Boop, boop, boop. Sea moth's gonna require a few things. This is not. We have to actually go to the mobile station, but. Sea moth requires. What? It's a power cell, titanium ingots, glass, lubricant, and lead. Okay, no problem. Let's see, there's the lubricant we need. Uh, here's the lead we need. Here's a power cell. It's charge is shitty, but that's okay. It's probably the best thing to use it with right now. Um, power cell. We need a bunch of titanium. Ten, in fact. That's nine. That's ten. And some glass, which I think I may have used all of it. We're gonna have to go get some of that real quick. Almost there. Alright. So how do we make glass again? Quartz? Well, maybe I have some of that, actually. I do. Because we need two glass and I have four quartz. Imagine that. We also want replacement power cells for the Cyclops. True. Question, asking for a friend. Can you make a power cell charger and put it in the Cyclops? Is that a thing I can do? Yes? Fantastic. Well, in that case, hold on a minute. I need a few things here. If I can install things, then I'm going to. Um, chargers, where's these chargers? They're probably at the bottom. Wall lockers, battery charger. We want one of those and one of those. If I can manage it. Which I might be able to. Welcome aboard, Captain. Let's see. I need wiring kits, copper. Uh, it's always with the wiring kits with this thing. And then do I have the red rocks? I do. Fantastic. So it's going to be silver ahoy. That's what I'm seeing here. We're going to need to go get some silver and some copper. Never mind, we have the copper, but I am going to need silver. Always oh, silver. Okay. Got more enough batteries. All oh, this is fine. Let's go ahead and make the copper wire now. Alright, this thing takes silver. This thing's gonna take. So we need four silver. Uh, it's always something. Some gold. Okay, computer chip. Computer requires. More gold, more copper wire, and the samples, which I do have. Take those. One more gold. We need one more copper. Never mind. Got that. Yeah, go ahead and make this now. Make this one here. Okay, so now I just need uh, four silver. Four silver, how to do it. Yeah, it's nighttime. Didn't they change the infinite energy thing? 
I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. You recommend getting a mod station and a battery charger? You know, actually, now that I think about it, I don't need a battery charger. I'll just take the one that's inside my base. That's a terrible idea. Yeah, we're gonna make another one. Uh, okay, we need silver though. I was thinking I could just steal the ones in my bases and put them out there, but probably not the best idea. Okay. Let this do its thing. There we go. One silver. Nope. I do wish it was its own ore. That way, when you scan for it, you can just go get it. What can you do? Let's see, where is this? Ah, it's inside this cave here, huh? Okay, don't you even think about it. Don't you think about it. Nope. Got an oxygen. Eh, we're gonna be traveling a bit of a ways, it's okay. Do I even have the bronze suit blueprint? I do! Yes! In fact, we've collected, I think, one of the arm upgrades for it as well. That's two silver, I think, right? Yep. All right, two more. Yeah, no, prawn is definitely an option. Um, not sure if I want it or not, though. There's one more, one more silver. Come on. Yeah, I haven't really seen any arguments for getting the prawn. Obviously, you can get the big old chunks that are lying around, which is like, eh, that's cool, I guess. But, uh... Unless that gives me, like, unlimited oxygen, I don't know. Seems more like I've become a sitting duck than anything else. These are the seamoth I can kind of get away. Alright. Well, that was fun. Let's see. Where is it? There's three in here somewhere. There's the silver I needed. Okay. Well, we're good. Get out of here. Good enough. That'll do. Goes deeper, becomes Spider Man is awesome. Well, that requires us to have the Spider-Man add-on, though, doesn't it? Like, that's not something it can automatically do. So, there's that light problem. Alright. Thank you. So, now we just go in here, finish our, uh... Finish what we were doing, and we can move on. Let's see. Wiring kit. Advanced wiring kit. Wiring kit. Take a lot more hits. I guess that's useful, I guess. Can I use items while in the prawn? Like, can I still use my laser gun while in the prawn? Because that'd be something. So where do I make these? Where do I make a battery charger and all that shit? It's right here, isn't it? Maybe not. Oh, no, no, no. I know what this is. It's, uh... Here. Uh, we actually need to use this in the Cyclops. Which 
is very hard to miss, and somehow I'm missing it. Um, giant yellow submarine. There it is. Prawn is not optional. Is that right? Well, then maybe we will end up getting the prawn instead of the sea moth. We'll see. All right. But first things first. This is where all the power cells are. Ooh, it's all running. Um, let's see where we can put this. I think in here would be fine. So we need power cell charger. That one. Let's put it. Bleh. Here's good. Can always move it. Cool. I also want to make a battery charger. Uh, let's put it on the same wall. Fantastic. Those are done. Get that out of here. What does it take for a fabricator? Oh. Yeah, we should have done that. Uh, and then this one. Uh, important, but also not super important. I don't know. Okay. So that can do our batteries. I do have a power cell. Let's go ahead and get that card. Let's get that going. Do I have extra batteries that need charging? Not that need charging. Cool. All right. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> what does it take to make a prawn? What are we talking here? Prawn suit. Where are you at? Do, do, do. Cyclops. Prawn grappling arm. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, I do have that. Hey, awesome. Uh, prawn. Hmm. And that is some advanced shit right there. Okay. Maybe. Your dad's prawn is Mecha Godzilla. Your dad has taste. Um, where? Here we are. Mine was Fisto. Fisto Roboto. But he doesn't just fist. And the best part is. He's learning. Alright. Prawn needs plasteel, aerogel. Aerogel, that one I'm not familiar with. I don't think I can even make that. How... How do you aerogel? Yeah, we don't have that one. Well, that settles that. No prawn. Alright, let's go to the mobile station. Whee! Also, while I'm here, beacon manager, um, I want to turn off this one. That's all well and good. Everything else is fine. There's the academy. Gonna accidentally run out of power in the worst place possible. It'll be fine. Don't worry about it. You guys are always so worried about everything. I have plenty of power. 93%. We're A-OK. -okay. Alright. Let's see, so we gotta head to the Neptune. thing is huge but it is basically a mobile base which is pretty cool Let's see there's the mobile platform over there okay let's go get the sea moth I think you find gel sacks near life pod 12 is that so did he not take the power cell charger? I have a, it's it's inside the car. Don't worry about it. 
Did I not take the power cell charger? Come on. Seamoth. Oh, I used... Oh, I'm charging the power cell. Hold on a minute. <laughs> Whoops. I knew I had that for some reason. This is not my thing. Oh, it says it on the front? Oh, that's kind of cool. Yeah, please hold. Uh, power cell charger. Yep, yeah, gonna need that. Thanks. Okay. Thanks, Threnode. Have a good one. Okay. Uh, up. Now you can't hear the fish splat. Problem solved. Exactly. See, that's really what we were all after this entire time. Seamoth, please. If you hold on to your dead power cells, you can actually use them to build new items and it'll fully charge them again. Yeah, I kind of figured this kind of what I was doing with the Seamoth. This was originally at 1% before I, uh, threw it in here. Alright. So let's see, so this... Should be, oh yeah. Oh, oopsies. <laughs> oh my yes. Oh, that's fun. And does this heal it while it's here? I'm assuming not. I don't think it does. But that's what I'm here for. Let's see. And put the gun in number one. There we go. Can I just, uh... No, not really. Okay, well, we can do that when we get out there. Anywho. Oh, good, it's nighttime. Oh, that's why the scanner's gonna help. Cool. Alright, chat. <laughs> We're ready. We're ready and rocking. Where's, um... That's where we're going. Scanner on, please. Oh my. Oh my, yes. Full Emergency throttle ahead. Emergencies beaming. Vessel counterfeit. Excessive noise. I'm not worried about the noise. Not where we're currently at, anyway. Um. <laughs> what? I think we hit something. Engine overheat. Engine overheat. Alright, alright, alright. Slow down, slow down. What the hell? Wow, that ate up a lot of energy. Really? Huh. Or is that the sonar? The sonar is doing that. It's fine. It's fine. I have a repair tool. No! You know, maybe we shouldn't do that. <laughs> In retrospect. Oh no, the health is fine. The health is a-okay. But yeah, let's, let's not just like rub against the entire bottom of the, the thing there. Uh, where, how can we do this? How can we get around here? Ah, this is gonna be a pain in the butt. This is gonna be a bit of a pain. Come on. Nope, too big. Too big. Okay. Who was it that was calling that this was going to be a complete disaster? <laughs> you you win! Oh, uh, let's see here. I am not a pilot. This much is... this much is true. Okay, let's find the, uh... Like, what am I stuck on now? God damn. Who thought this was a good idea? <laughs> So I can see what's going on here. Okay. Alright, let's go this way. We'll work our way around it. Life pod 19 is the one with this gel sacks. Okay. We'll keep that in mind. But first, we're going to go to uh, the next story beat. I want to see the next story beat.
So is that the yeah it is. Alright, where am I? Where am I? There I am. Oh, it's not gonna count it? While I'm in the Oh no, yeah, it did. Okay. Or I hope it does anyway. Alright, so we are basically around. I just need to kind of even out and get there. Got it. Alright. Well, this is nice. This is nice. I can work with this. <laughs> What'd you miss? Looks like a lot. Uh, not really. We just found enough pieces to actually make the, uh... Cyclops, so we did that, and uh, we're just kind of using it to get to the Degasi habitat here. That's pretty much it. Everything else has just been kind of grinding for materials and such. Okay, plenty of room this way. Huh? Okay. Ah. <sighs> I'm in his which he is actively crashing. Yeah, that's uh, <laughs> accurate. Despite finding the uh, the sonar upgrade, we are not good at piloting. That's okay though. It's doing what it's supposed to do. Where I've completely missed it. There it is down there. We've not missed it at all. Man, those whales sound like something else in there. All right. So what's this thing's depth meter? Oh, good, 500. Fantastic. Exactly what we needed. So they just went down here, huh? They just they just up and did that. Why did they do that? It's like so dark down here. I'm, <laughs> I'm terrified to ask questions. Slowly getting there. God, it's so fucking dark down here. I am not okay with this. Um, turn off the sonar for now. Two hundred meters, still lower. Let's see if we can back this up a little bit. Let's just, let's just sink. Got a little stuck on things. Oopsies. Oopsies. Sonar back on, please. Okay. What are these things? I don't like any of this. So it's 200 meters that way. Huh? Oh, those fucking things. Oh, no. Well, it's okay. They can't get inside, probably. It's fine. What is this? Heat area, okay. Alright, so we are close. <clears throat> We're close, we're close. Let's go down a little further. Try my best to pilot through all this crap. Yeah, what were they thinking going this low? Why would they do this? 452 meters. Hey, Baron. Ah, uh, <laughs> well, <clears throat> I was enjoying it until it, the game wanted me to go to 500 meters below the fucking ocean. It's uh, getting less, less exciting. Oh, we got fucking EMP'd. <sighs> okay, we're fine. Everything's fine. It's fine. 
They're just constantly doing it, but it's fine. How are the batteries doing? Detecting a titanium mass somewhere in this area. Unable to confirm whether it originated on the Aurora. Hi! Can you not? Please? Fucking Metroid? Okay. Where is... Where do we go? Where? 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 We are at maximum depth. I have a feeling this is uh, where we get out. It's 41 meters that way? That's fine. Oh, this is gonna be a, this is a real problem. Uh, okay. Gun! <laughs> yeah. No, I'm taking care of it. Oh, no, and it's- and we're lowering. Oh, fuck. Oh, jeez. <laughs> Working on it. Working on it. Go up, please. Okay. It's fine. It's fine. Everything's fine. Slow down. This fucking thing. You need to go away. I'ma kill you. You're not supposed to kill things in this game, but I'ma do it. Come here. Hi. How's it go- Jesus. There's two of you? Hmm. Now then. Come here. Mess with my ship? Huh? That's what I thought. Where's your brother? Come here. Okay. What were you? Yes, I thought. Right then. All better. Let's uh. <laughs> let's let's see. Let's ch let's assess the damage. Okay, health looks good. Damage around the entire ship seems to be nominal. No issues there. The batteries, however, are a little low. Take those out. Get those charging. While we're out and about. Seamoth is useless at this point. It's too deep. <laughs> is the stasis rifle modded? Uh, no. No. There is. I have made no changes to the, mo the rifle. That is just how it works. Okay. Um... Yeah, here it is. <laughs> so, now that we've murdered everything around us, let's uh, let's see what they got going on here. Excuse me? <laughs> you again? We're gonna do this. We're, we're really gonna do this? Alright. Your loss. I just couldn't let it go. You just couldn't let it go. Bye bye. Okay. Anyway, how do we get in here? Ah, through the massive hole. That would do it. Yeah. Okay, nothing here. Mm -hmm. All right. Please stop fighting and listen. We're sick. What? How? You've been coughing, right? Feeling itchy, blisters? Yeah. The biometrics would have warned us if we were sick. It's something new. It's not in the database. Come on, then. What's it gonna do? Turn us inside out? Dissolve us into jelly? It's an alien bacteria. It's everywhere. Every organism on this planet. Copy. It's altering our genetic code. Uh, how are the creatures surviving if they're infected? I don't know yet. Want me to cut some of them open for you? Find out what makes them tick? No. Just tell me what you need, son. Materials. Equipment. Just... Can I have some quiet? I need some time to think. So, they're all infected, so that's good. Always good. Alright, so we will get there. Where's the second floor, though? I somehow missed the second floor. Yeah, 
Got to get back in there. Uh, but first, where is my ship? Let's restock on air real quick. So we don't have to rush or take our time. There we go. Got to turn off the engines. Do we? I mean, okay, we can. That's fine. How do I turn them off? <laughs> yeah, sure. How do I do that? Turn the lights off there. Let's see. How are these doing? Oh, they're hanging in there. It's our upgrades. Oh, well, yeah, it is actually, in fact, running low on energy. Okay. Yep, nope. Good call, chat. Good call. Um, just as soon as I remember how to turn this off. Steering wheel. External, silent running. Activate sonar. It's low. Engine powering down. Ah, there we go. Okay. Good call, chat. Good call. Thank you. These are 57, considering they were at zero, that's actually not bad. Right, back to it. Okay, let's see here. Uh, back to it. Zip, zap, zoop. And a crack in the hole here. I need to go up. How do we go up? Nothing like that. Hmm. Wait for it. Surely they didn't send me here just for a single blueprint and a coffee machine. How do we get in you? How do I get inside here? There will be a way. Ah, well, you know. The front door might be <laughs> an option here. Alright. Hearing horrible noises. Not keen on that. What's this? A Cyclops shield generator, you say? Well, that could possibly be useful. Oh, there's the way down. Alright, perfect. Um, what else you got for me? I have had it with you, risking our lives. Oh, stow it, Chief. The kid can't kill this disease without fish to study. I'm just bringing him home. What? Tell her. Tell her I'm right. You're both wrong. Marguerite, I can't find out how they resist the bacteria if you slaughter them all. It ain't always they oblige in coming in alive. He means you're being reckless. Father, the outcome's no better if we hole up in here and don't go outside. But we have to find a middle way. There is no compromise. Not while she's on my sea base. Your sea base? I'm going outside. New blueprint acquired. has disembarked the habitat. Bart, come in. It's dangerous. Damn it, boy. I know you can hear me. Chief. Chief, get off the radio and put on your helmet. What? Brace! Ooh. Well, that's good. Hey, orange tablet. I should probably scan this, though. Where? Where? Where did it go? I dropped it. <laughs> I thought I dropped it. Where did it go? Oh, no! <laughs> Where? No! Did the game eat it? Oh, I hope the game didn't need it. I dropped it right here. The air is fine. The air is fine. We have a whole nother... We have a whole nother air tank. I'm more concerned about the, uh... The orange key that I had in my hands and then immediately dropped. There it is. Thank God. It just didn't look orange. Okay. So first things first... We're panicking. There we go. Problem solved. All right. Orange tablet. Home slightly displays orange lid. N. OK. 
Okay. Let's grab this and we'll get out of here. Me that hardened blade. Are you out of your mind? You brought that thing here? What if it's not as dead as it looks? What if others come? You prefer it got curious and came of its own accord, or got messed up and dragged here? When we get off this planet, I am going to drag you through every court in the damn Federation. So she's fun. She brought a Leviathan back home? That seems like kind of a bad idea. Chad, I see you yelling about an egg. I will grab said egg. Give me a moment. I did not think the egg was important. I thought it was just another creature egg. We will fix that mistake. After I charge these power cells a little bit. Okay. My bad, my bad. Although, do we really want... Do we really want an egg that is probably from a leviathan? Dude, is that... Is that wise? Clearly, they had it and bad things happened to them. I, I don't know. I don't know about that one, chat. This seems like a bad idea. Alright, we're picking up the egg. Why not? Okay. Also scan this aquarium. Didn't we already we already have the life aquarium. Welcome aboard, Captain. All systems online. Creature egg. I can't just drop it here and scan it. Dang it. There are no Leviathan eggs that you can get and hatch. Darn, missed opportunity. Change our two tank. Also a good idea. All right. Right then. Let's see. You aren't charging shit? What are you talking about? Oh, wait, what, why? Why aren't I charging anything? My batteries are char recharging themselves? How does that work? You put it in the aquarium and drop it inside. Okay, we can do that. Oh, they are actually doing that. Oh, no. Yeah, wait. How do we... <laughs> how do we... How do we fix this? Shoot. Also, we didn't get a shield upgrade. We just can make one in the future. That's what's going on there. Hmm. I see. Okay. I'm picking up what you guys are putting down. So I can't... So what you're saying is I can't just attach, like, say, for example, um, some solar panels to the top of this thing. No, that's not a thing I can do. Because <coughs> if so, I mean, that'd be pretty sweet. Okay, uh, hmm. So a few things. First off, the blueprints, um... We no longer need the sea moth. Get that out of there. The prawn suit is a work in progress. As is this thing. I would like those eventually, but let's hold off on that for now. I'd rather focus on some other things here. There's an upgrade that charges the Cyclops via thermal vents. That'd be pretty cool. Hmm. 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 <laughs> Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah, right. This mod that allows the Cyclops to regain power, but the mod is in the mountain wreck. It was guarded by Reggie's brother. Fun. Cool. Or build bases with generators in place that you pass often. Yeah, you could do that too, I suppose, huh? Well, shoot. What do we do now? We've done that. I guess we can go back to base. Ah, oh, the... 
The long-term goals here are to build this Neptune patch, which I think is where we're at here, which also requires air gel and nickel. I've made these two already. It's nickel and the aerogel. All right. Well, chat. Engine powering up. I have a rebreather. Yeah, what are you on about? If in doubt, go deeper. That is probably true. Not super keen on it, but probably true. All right. Well, how about this? Here's what we're gonna do. Where am I in comparison to everything? Way the fuck over here? Okay. And these are all these heat vents. Oh, God. Let's go back to base so I can make some power cells so we can kind of switch things around here. Oopsies. Nope. <laughs> Don't let go. See if we can't get out of this mess. There's a hole. Might be too small though. There's another one of those fucking things. That... Don't come after me. I killed all your brethren. I can kill you too. Yeah, that that'll do. That's a larger opening. Oh, come on. Get through. There you go. There you go. <laughs> I got it, ship. I got it. Don't worry about it. It's fine. Alright. We made it. Where is... Base. There's base. Okay, head in that general direction. For a while. Hey, Ixie. How's it going? We really need gel sacks? We sure do. We sure do. Alright, chat did tell me. Chat did tell me where there was gel sacks. It was one of the, uh, the pods. Yeah, we can turn up the speed, you're right. Now that we're out and about, we can turn up speed. Yeah, so if chat, which life pod was it that has the aerogels? Let's make that our next one. 19, thank you. Well, um, well, we have a minute here. Uh, do, do, do. Do I have 19? Yes, I do. Where's that at? You know, it's not that far. It's certainly closer than home. Let's do it. We got energy. We'll be alright. Probably. It'll be fine. Yeah, it'll be fine. Okay. Hit the fast thruster button. Uh, the last time I did that, the entire thing started to overheat. I think that is for emergencies only. Recall your Cyclops beacon? Oh, good pull. Yeah, we will do that. We will do that. Look for the small balls with purple spots. What, you mean those things? <laughs> those things I've been avoiding this entire time? Is that what we're talking about? I guess I should have actually scanned them. Oh, those aren't purple, are they? Those are blue. And I'm stuck on a rock. There we go. We're fine. Everything's fine. Okay. Let's see. Please hold. Need to reorient myself here. Uh, right down there, 175 meters. How? How? Up and over, I guess? I don't remember this part. Just swim to it? Oh well, give me a minute, give me a minute. We're basically over it, then this is where it's going to be. That's okay. Alright. <laughs> We're here, Reggie! I'm 
I'm the captain now. Alright. Engine's off? Yeah, good point, good point. Always forget. Gotta make that a habit. Yeah. Engine off. There we go. This one you would recommend getting its seeds? Yeah, that makes sense. Don't really want to come back here. I can avoid it. Yeah! Let's see. There's life pod 19. These things, huh? Shell sack. Right. Uh, While well, I'm here, we were a little low on quartz earlier, so grab those while they're hot. That's a creature egg, don't care about it. Lithium, because again, we're here, why not? There's another one of these. Fish. I'm not quite sure how many of these we're going to need, so we'll just grab as many as we can see. Of which there are many. Perfect. I did use some ruby earlier. Restock on that a little bit. Good, it's all good. I'll grab all these and then that should do it. Great drag, great drag. Use something. Table coral. Really? about does it that about does it plenty of quartz to replenish our stock a couple rubies eh, a few more Good enough, let's get out of here. Welcome Whew. Captain. All systems online. Right, let's see here. And then chat was correct. We do need to fix our beacon here for the Cyclops and the Seamoth. Awesome. All right. We will figure out how this all works back at base. Let's go. Engine powering up. Boop boop. All aboard. On your right as you enter the sub lockers. Oh yeah, you're nice. Your Seamoth also doesn't have a cool name yet. We didn't name the last one, which I guess is a good thing, considering that one got exploded, but, uh, yeah, no, we don't really need the, the inventory space, unfortunately. Kind of took away that little tidbit. Well, that's okay, though. Uh, a little higher, please. Let's not run aground on that. Okay. You can stab the purple things for seeds? Good to know. We will do that for one of them. You could say it was all yellow, but you could also sing We All Live in a Yellow Submarine. Take your pick. Pick your genre. It's up to you. Full speed. That's fine. It's fine.
Full throttle. Oop, well, killed that entire fleet of fish. <laughs> How did it explode? It got attacked by skull sharks? Is that what that breed of fish is called? A bunch of fish came after it basically and just destroyed it. I left the light on. Didn't realize it was going to be a problem. Alright, here is good enough. Oh, wait. Lemon. Turn off the power, buddy. Okay, so, we are going to take this off of here, because clearly this is not the way to do this. Yeah. How do I deconstruct the queue? Okay, we will leave, well, we'll leave that one there. Just because I feel like that might be useful. These are 30%. Let's unload those. Let's uh, charge them all periodically. Um, okay. Maybe get a fabricator instead? What would that do? Also, I left the lights on again. <laughs> Should probably stop doing that. Should also put the seamoth here so we can repair it a little bit, but that's okay. It's fine. Everything's fine. How do I get in here? How do I get in my own base? Alright. Welcome aboard, Captain. So, first order of business. Um Power Cell Charger. Put that here. Fabricator and a radio for the long travels. Is there going to be a lot of long travels? I feel like we're kind of getting somewhere here. All right, so that's all good. That's working out well. Uh, I don't have any batteries to charge. Well, that's not true. I have plenty of batteries to charge. Let's pop that out. This one's fine. Pop that out. And that one. And this one. Pump those in there. Hello, radio. This is Life Pod 2 coordinates attached. We're way past our safe depth and bleeding O2. We'll have to swim for the surface, but it's 500 meters straight up. We'll make for the rendezvous and keep you posted. Out. Hmm. Location uploaded to PDA. Hmm. Well, all right then. I know where we're going. Uh, I was just about to ask, what are we going to do now? Game answered it for us. Let's turn this one red. So we can see it a little more clearly. In comparison to everything else. Alright, cool. Uh, we're going to let those batteries charge real quick. I'm just going to let those batteries charge. Then we'll take our sea moth. Or rather, no, we won't. We'll take the academy itself. Take the academy and get out of here. Can I just go? No, you have to be in this. Would you? Really? For a shame. <laughs> the habitat's not happy about having to charge everything. That's good. I think it's because there was a bit of an eclipse there. Um, I should have more than enough these. Okay, let's see. Oh, you can access... Oh, look at that. Okay, that's cool. Another radio call. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Hmm. Let's see. Yeah, we're running a little low on cell power here. See if we can't get this working. Um, why don't you go ahead and turn off all the lights too while you're at it? Okay. Yeah, 
What's happening to my solar power up there? A cloudy day? Is that the problem? Naturally. Remember the arrow gel. Yes. I shall remember the arrow gel. Playing partially translated broadcast. Uh-huh. <laughs> well, Chad, I think we're the only ones left. Call me crazy. We might be the only ones left here. Insufficient power. Yeah, I kind of figured this might be a problem. Um, let's see. Let's take these out so that it can charge itself that way and have a little bit more power. There you go. These are more important. It's hunting. I know it's hunting. I'm aware. Mm, yeah, this thing is basically on life support. It's going between one and zero power. We should probably do better than that. Um, am I feeling safer? Yes. I am. Where is... Let's see. You guys were talking about the aquarium? Is that what I need? Or the indoor grow bed? What do we need to start making some stuff here? Well... <laughs> yeah, I'm just gonna go to bed. <laughs> it's fine. There's there's oxygen in here, right? Outdoor grow bed and large aquarium. That's what we need? Okay. You guys done yet? Alright. So let's see. Let's see what we got. First things first. Here's the exterior grow bed. Okay, that's very easy to make. We like that. Alien containment. Probably not what we're looking for. We you guys said a large aquarium? Hmm, I do not have the large aquarium. Okay. Let's see. That's all miscellaneous. I won't be in there. Where's the... Um, here it is, bioreactor. Oh, again with the wiring kits. God. Always the wiring kits. Okay. Well. Let's see what we can do here. These gel sacks. We have to look into how we do this here. Oh, alien containment. Okay, okay, okay. Good. Glad to hear it. All right, so first things first. Alien containment is going to require some glass, which we definitely have enough quartz to make. So that's great. Exterior grow bed. I can just do right now. Let's put it... A key. Beautiful. And in here... I'd love to use this planter. ...is a proven survival strategy. Simon Chelensky survived 47 months on a healthy, raw salad of live tree roaches and stag root. Good for him. Let's scan this too. Haven't done that yet. I think I realized I need to wait, plant the gels, then knife them. Is that what you're saying? Let's see. Eh? Really? You're gonna, you're gonna try to. Really? <sighs> Give me a minute. Not even worth the charge. Okay, come here. You gonna come to my house? <laughs> Try to eat my crops? That's what I thought. Okay. So we have to knife one of these, huh? Boop. Oh. Okay. Now what? Now plant them again, I assume? Oh, yeah, look at that. So each one of these is going to give me like four. Eh. 
Interesting. Okay. Well, let's do this. I've got some in my person now, so we can still keep going, but uh, we can also plant these seeds. Okay, we can do one more. Alright, hold on. If we're gonna do this, we're gonna do it right. There we go. Alright, we'll let that grow. Don't mess with my garden. That's right. Never mess with a man's garden. Hey, there we go. We're at full power. Now to immediately make that a problem again. There we go. Okay. That's good, though. That's a start. Um, let's see. You can also plant other stuff. Not necessary, but useful. Yeah, I get you. I get you. We needed glass. Oh, hey, aerogel. Gel sack and ruby. Hmm. Okay. Poor thing only wanted a snack. Poor thing tried to make me a snack. Don't you poor thing that. We can now make orange tablets if we find nickel. Okay. Oh, let's see here. Poor thing couldn't defend itself. Poor thing had teeth. <laughs> it tried to use them. <laughs> Alright, let's see. We can almost make that. It creates a temporary barrier around the sub, rendering it invulnerable for a brief time. That's cool and all. I'm not too worried about that. Probably should be, but I'm not. Uh, in containment. That's what I wanted. So we need two more glass. And then I need to go grab some titanium. I feel like I'm protective of my animals too? Oh, absolutely. You kidding? I raise the damn things from from eggs. More often than not. Alright, what am I doing? So yeah, I'm gonna be protective about it. It's a serious time investment and emotional attachment. Take one more of those just in case. Um glass titanite. Titanite, titanite, titanite. I think I need three. Okay. Uh, I only need two. Joke's on me. Now go for Reggie. Somehow I don't feel like that's a good idea. We could try, but I don't think that's really in the plans. This needs to go inside the base, doesn't it? Alright. Um... Can I attach tubes to this thing, I wonder? What about vertical? Can I go vertical? No, that's the, that's the wrong thing. That's not what I wanted. I mean, this thing. Vertical is definitely not happening. What about eye compartments? Yeah, we can. Let's do that. Okay. And that's probably not enough room what we need so not a scanner room observatory is kind of cool but costs stuff multi-purpose does not fit there but hold on if we do how do I flip this around how is this a uh, yep there we go so if I do that, and then I do this, no, no, doesn't, you don't want to, really? Can we finicky? Okay, alright, fine. What if I do another eye compartment? 
I'm stuck. Please help. Why isn't this working? No! Okay. Hmm. <clears throat> you have to build it first? Man. Alright. It's not gonna, it doesn't let you just set up a blueprint and then just kind of go at your leisure. It's a bummer. Well, that's stupid. Do, 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 Yeah, we usually stream for about three hours, give or take. We've been streaming for two. So we got a little bit of time left. We got a little bit of time left. Alright, so let's try this again. Multi-purpose room, please. Thank you. Just take that thing's entire space. Sorry, this is my habitat now. Get your own. Damage due to weak hull strength. Build reinforcements to remove weak parts. Excuse me? The hell does that mean? Weak core strength. There. Oh! <laughs> That's what it means. Uh-oh. How do we fix this? Um. Hmm. <laughs> um. Not laser cutter. Hello, little repair tool. Hello? Yeah, just put this on here. Too many rooms. Shit. Well, how do we... How do we make it not have too many rooms? You need foundation or reinforcement? What does that mean? What does that mean, chat? Alright. Uh, too big. Too big. Fix, fix, fix. Okay. Build habitat builder. Use habitat builder. You need reinforcements. Okay, let's see. Reinforcements. There's that foundation thing. Where would that be? Like down here? How do you... Hmm. And what's this reinforcement you guys keep talking about? Ah, oh, there it is. Increases hull tiger. Oh, we can make that. Okay, sure. So we're going to put this back on for a minute. Then, with a reinforcement, somehow, some way, I'm not quite sure how this works. This one, I guess. Oh, you have to do it to all the parts? Oh, no, that's terrible. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. Alright, so how the found how's the foundation work? Yeah, I understand not all the parts are gonna need it, but it's it uh oopsies. It looked like it said it needed like six. Like six of the parts needed it. Which is insane. It has seven strength per reinforcement. Hmm. Let me try this real quick, and then, if this doesn't work in our favor. I think I did this completely wrong. Okay. Alright, fine. If it'll come for the entire base, it'll come for the entire base. We'll try it. No harm. No harm in it, I guess. All this so we can put an egg. Okay. Hole is now at 6.8. Allegedly fine. This is full of water. It's fine. Everything is fine. Cool. Well. <laughs> now what? <laughs> mm. There it is. Okay. Yep, no, take your time. Please, air. <laughs> Getting a little spicy. <sighs> okay. Okay. 
The egg, not just any egg. Yeah, you guys keep saying that. You guys keep saying that, but it doesn't mean anything to me, so... As far as I'm concerned, it is just the egg. Or a egg. An egg? Goddamn. Oh, wow, this thing takes up the entire room, huh? Yep, that's fine. This is the egg room. Have the plants grown? Probably. Provide an ideal opportunity to okay. Fauna up close. Select carefully which life forms you bring on board. They may also be studying you. Yeah, alright. That's not ominous at all. Um, how do I use this? Build hatch on it. Oh, okay. God. Such a... Some nonsense, I'll tell you. We're going to put this all the way over here. It's out of the way. I don't have enough titanium, <laughs> apparently. Please hold. If it ain't one thing, it's another. Alright. Uh, yeah, those have absolutely grown. Cool. So let's see. One, two, three. Leave one for that. One, two, three. One, two, three. Leave one. Leave one. Leave one. No. Hold on. Hold your horses. Alright. I think I did the math right there. Let's see. Knife. Okay. Planter. Seeds. Perfect. How these batteries looking? Splendid. We'll take those. We should go get some more real quick. Um, where is submarine? There it is. Welcome aboard, Captain. All Can't see shit. The there we go. Okay, here is that, here is that, this one's fine, good, good, perfect, fully charged, love to see it, see what is fine. I'm assuming that leaving the lights on is not gonna, uh, not, let's just not risk it. What do I think of the game so far? It's pretty good. Um, a little grindy. A little grindy, which we have kind of nullified a bit, but it's still got some grind to it, despite the mods I've been putting in. Um, but otherwise, yeah, it's pretty good. I'm sure the lights are a minimal drain, but, uh, you know, better safe than sorry. Let's right, so take all this. Go out here. Nope, it's this one. Okay. Get the build gun out. Nope, what are you doing? There we go. Enter alien containment. Enter? Oh no, we don't want to do that. And put egg? Nope, that's the planter. There's a planter in here? Oh, whatever. I guess, uh... Boop. Okay. Yeah, my inner dad is makes me turn off all the submarine lights, for sure. Well, you're definitely alive. And you look happy. So that's something. Well, that's something. Well, while we're waiting on that, let's go uh let's go see what happened with that life pod, huh? 
Let's go check out that life pot. Is there anything else we need? We need the arrow gel for the prawn suit. That's what we were working on currently. There's the arrow gel. Alright, so let's see. Blueprints. Let's get the prawn going and then we will uh, head out. I think that is the order of the day. Want one of those. It's the only thing I do want. And the prawn itself is where? There it is. Okay. Alright, let's see. Benzine, I know I have that in the locker there. Uh, two aerogels. We need two of those, huh? Okay. There we go. Uh, plasteel. We're doing the plasteel thing again. Okay. And we also need s uh, the glass. Okay, so we're gonna need some glass. I have some diamonds already. Plasteel is going to require... Oh, are we actually running low on titanium? What? In this economy? We need two of these. Okay. Those. The plasteel itself requires some lithium. I'm going to need three. I saw diamonds. Lithiums. Alright. I do have a stalker tooth around here somewhere. There's that. So there's the enameled glass, and that's a prawn. Now the hard part. We need one lithium, one benzene, and the stupid fucking advanced wiring kit again. I hate those so much, and I don't know why. There's that. Lithium. There we go. Wiring kit. Advanced wiring kit. Okay. Let's see. Advanced wiring kit requires wiring kit, gold, and a computer chip. Computer chip requires some copper wire. I don't think I have any copper. Probably need some more gold. Might need some of this later. Pretty sure I'm out of copper again. Yep. All right. Cool. All right. Let's see. Uh, no. We need copper. I will probably need silver later too, but that's fine. Okay, here we go. Forward! I wish these regenerated! There's one of the coppers. I think that's the only one we needed, but we're going to get some more anyway, just in case. One more cut. Okay, well, that answers that. Yay! Alright, that's good enough. So now that's done. Go ahead and get a setup for finding that silver. I think we need it, but I don't quite remember. Alright. So let's see. Electronics. Get the copper wire going. Good. There's the computer chip we need. And I need the advanced wiring kit, which requires the wiring kit, which requires silver. Just confirming that I do not have any. There's a big old negative. Big old zilch, nada, nothing. Cool. 
Oops, I needed two of those leads. There we go. All right. Yeah, so let's see. You beat this game three times? Why? Why you do that? Because it's kind of the same each time, yes? Unless I've missed my mark. Chat seems to know where to send me every time, so it's not like the map is changing. Whoa. Okay, I'll just go into this tiny little tube. That's fine. Not claustrophobic at all. I guess with certain mods and stuff, you would make it a lot different. So that could be cool. There is quite the extensive modding community for this game, that's for sure. Never gonna catch me. Uh, that one might. Meow. Okay. There's another chunk in there. I want it. I came here for the chunks. I'm gonna get the chunks. Okay. Things just kind of farting in here. That's fun. Yeah, it's stuck. The base building for you is the best part? That makes sense. Yeah, that you could do differently every time. That's fair. Says the guy who's been Dark Souls at Ungodly number of times. Listen. <laughs> yeah, no, fair play. Fair play. I was about to argue, like, well, hold on a minute, because Dark Souls, when you play it differently, is going to have, like, different weapons you can try, and you can do different challenge. Nah, you're right. You're right, you're right. It's not like some... It's... Very few games are so rigid that playing it once is going to be like playing it a second time. So. Good call. I'll eat my words on that one. Oh, my toes. Missing a toe or two after that one. Where, where is all this? Come on. Okay, I think that was enough silver. I think we're good. Okay, I lost another toe. Let's head this way. If we bump into those sandstone chunks, all the better. If not, I won't. I won't freak out about it. I was wondering why I wasn't taking a lot of damage. I just remembered that we have the reinforced suit. Forgot about that. It's really helping. Yeah, Sekiro, unfortunately, is one of those games where, like, eh, there's not a whole lot different you can do. You can use, like, different, um... You could try using different tools, I guess, but... Overall, though, yeah, the game's kind of the same. Okay, and this is the last thing we need? Yes. Reinforced suit is a must, too. Oh, well, don't worry, we've got it. We've already got that one. Now then. Prawn. Prawn probably is the mobile unit, if I had to guess. I'm just gonna take the sea I'm just gonna take the sea glide over there. We still have to turn off the scanner. That's my bad. Baron, you're literally playing Sakura right now. Why? I mean, for fun, then okay. Because it is kinda relaxing when you get really into the rhythm. But uh yeah, I don't know. I don't know, man. I don't know. We... I just... You know, if I... I am kind of loath to play things again if it's not going to be different. It's just how I am. Don't have time, you know? I ordered the prawn achievement. Prawn operators receive weeks of training to counteract this phenomenon. You will have to make do with self-discipline. 
And there it goes. All right. So how do we give it a super arm? How do we give you a super arm? How do I make a super arm and give it to you? You have storage. I can enter it. You certainly look cool. Yeah, chat's gonna fit. Yeah! Look at me go! It does swim. Okay, good. I was a little worried about that. It doesn't swim well. But it can move a little bit. Oh, I see. There's a charge bar. Oh, so it can't actually swim swim. It just kind of hovers. Upgrade table? Okay. Thrust only. Oh, yeah, you did do that. Why did you do that to yourself? Why did you do that to yourself, Baron? We need a moon pool station? Excellent! We have one of those. Give me a moment. Those are all back again. Get up there. Come on, little prawn. You can do it. Come on! There you go. Okay. Oh! Uh, hmm. <laughs> what, what happened here? Why did this suddenly get all full of everything? This shouldn't have happened. This wasn't attached to anything. How did... Whatever. Alright. Not sure what happened there. So anyway, once this all uh, comes back online... Um, prawn. I think we're going to have to wait a minute. Okay. We'll just kind of wait a minute. Upgrade station should be over here. Why would you do emulation? Yeah, alright. That's fair. <laughs> Allow me to counteract that with a shut up! Yeah, no, you're right. I have no... I have no, uh, no room to, <laughs> no room to talk. Alright, so modification station is a negative. There is no prawn arm in the modification station. So that's not it. So maybe it is in the moon pool, and if that's the case, we just gotta wait for the moon pool to fix itself. I don't know why it was broken in the first place. Welcome aboard, Captain. I'm stuck. Alright. How... Access upgrades. Cool. This is, uh, this is where I would put it. How do I make it? There's a special crafting station you can only build in here. Is that right? Glad he told me about that. Um, okay. Well, let's see here. What are we talking about? We're talking about... Fabricated radio. I bumped into it with the suit. Oh, really? That broke it? Jesus. Alright, so uh, what's the... What do, what do we do? <laughs> Chat, help! What do I put? How do I put? Not seeing anything. Not seeing anything. I mean, we could put the modification station in here, but that doesn't... I don't think that's what you guys mean. Hmm. Well, let me turn the scanner off while you guys figure that out. Please turn this off. I cannot see. Thank you. It's a tech cache you have to find. Fun! The Blitzes seems to think that there's an inbuilt thing in the academy, though. Would that be the case? I kind of wonder. Academy thing's only for the academy? Boo. 
Well, then the prawn stays here. Although, you know... I feel like the sea moth is more of a... Because we can't use it where we're going. Can't really use it where we're going, so we should probably... We should probably swap him out. Launch. Hmm, that is cool though. All systems online. Put that there. Yep. Let's see if we can get in this. Where is my big ship? Is that way. What are the two upgrades in the bot? Oh, those are just arms. <laughs> it's like, do I have something that I don't recognize? What is that? All right, so we gotta do this properly. This could be a mess. Straight up. Ah, close enough. All right, prawn is engaged. Seamoth can now go. We will change the beacon color. Thank you, chat. Seamoth can now go into the moon pool. Alright. And uh that's about it. Let's uh let's get this party rolling. We got places to be. there been any multiplayer mods for Subnautica yet? There are. Yeah, I looked it up earlier because I was curious, and there's absolutely a multiplayer mod. So we can make the stupid prawn suit arm, but we can't actually upgrade it, which is frustrating. So frustrating. Okay. Ah, uh, the beacons, beacons, beacons. We're heading towards the red one. Prawn is yellow. That is inside my ship. Um, right, so starting to hallucinate a little bit. Gonna just ignore that. I feel like. I feel like we're just gonna ignore this. Get out of here. <laughs> okay. Now that's taken care of. Let's, uh, let's get going. Engines online. I want to go to the red. The red is to the left. I can't see shit. How's our power? 98%. Yeah, love it. Love to see it. I keep pressing E thinking that that will turn it slightly diagonally. That is not how this ship works. Let's go this way for a while. And, uh, yeah. Here we go. It followed me home. Can I keep it? Can I keep it? No. Absolutely not. Easy E. What up? Not much. We're just making some heavy progress. I think what we're going to try and do is we're going to try to get to this thing. We're going to check it out. And then, uh, from there, I think that might be the end of the stream. We're gonna find out from there, though. We'll see what happens. One thing at a time. Hmm. Getting a little shallow over here. We'll be okay. 
be okay. <laughs> it's fine. Chad, I think I'm starting to get the hang of this thing. The next Subnautica will have multiplayer. Are they making another one? They did the uh, Below Zero or whatever, right? Egg hatched. Is that what that was? Is it cuttlefish? Oh, it's a cuttlefish. I wonder if it's an actual cuttlefish? Because if it's an actual cuttlefish, that's horrifying. Seems like squids. Alright, here we go. Bring it down. meters. Steady as she goes. <laughs> we get a little light going on here. There we go. Nearly 300 meters. Ending. Get some weird wire, some weird life out there. This is looking like the Metroid territory. So be ready for that. Where is 60 meters? There it is. Uh, what? What are you doing? Don't, don't do that. Just gonna put you up just a smidgen. Okay. Powering down. Okay. All right. Uh, ship is a little lock, a little lopsided. It's fine. <laughs> it's probably fine. Okay. Let's see what we've got. Excuse me. Uh oh. Ow. What hit me? That little fish? You? Fuck you. Who's next? There you are. Where are you? You wanna hunt me? No, no, no. I'ma hunt you. Oh, you bitch. Interesting. Well, <laughs> that is a dilemma. Um, let's move forward. What you got for me? Useful. Can't go in there like that. Um, hi, hello. It's working. Okay, good news. We're alive and we've stopped sinking. Bad? The oxygen's going to run out in 30 minutes and we're 500 meters down. What do we do? We'll have to use the remaining juice to send a distress call and build whatever gear we can. Then we find a way to the surface. So they're not doing great. Um, hmm. Warp preserve immune to stasis. Yeah, I'm seeing that. Also, I'm seeing that the knife <laughs> gives off bubbles even when it's not underwater. Is that a Metroid? I think that was a Metroid. Okay. What did we get? Oh, we got the depth thing. Okay, that's useful. Yeah. Oh, well, did not mean to do that. Um, okay. Let's get out of here. I think we've had enough to do here. That was interesting.
Crab squid? Yeah, yeah, Metroid. That's what I said. <laughs> hmm. You hear there's an under entrance underground? For what, though? <laughs> cool. For what? Where are we? Over here. Okay. Alright. Let's head back that way. What version am I playing on? Uh, whoopsies. Uh, presumably the most advanced one? Considering it's on Steam and it's just, uh... Auto updates? Because you need to go deeper and this is the entrance. Creature attack? From who? What are you talking about? Where? Behind us? Probably just a crab squid, right? Probably just a Metroid, it's fine. Health of ship is decent. Energy is fine. It's gonna be okay. Reginald? Was that Reginald? He's not usually over here. Hmm. Whoops. Okay. Alright, chat. Is this the entrance we're talking about here? Yeah, it's a little deep for the Cyclops. We're not going to really actually go in there, but I can explore it a little bit. Warning. Maximum depth reached. Hull damage imminent. Warning. Creature attack. Again with this creature attack. Alright. Who's... Come here. Come to my house? Where are you at? What is this thing? To my house. Think you can just get away with this? You thought? You thought? Oh, absolutely not. Don't mess with my Cyclops. I spent hours getting this stupid fucking thing. And I have all the time in the world to kill you. So if you could please just die, that would be great. Oh, no, 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 This isn't how this works. You don't get to just go inside a rock. There we go. All right, that's problem solved. Um, how do we fix this ship? Probably from inside, huh? I saw we were leaking a little bit here and there. Yeah, how do we... Some damage in the back, it says. Are you serious? What is... Uh, got to kill everything. Now who? Is it another one? It's fucking another one, isn't it? Yup. <laughs> gotcha. Alright. Here we go. Can't have anything nice. Can't have anything nice in this house. Are you dead? You look dead. No, not dead. Now you're dead. That's better. Does anyone else want to play? No. Okay. Good. Moving on. Christ. Repair outside? Okay. We will. 
One moment, please. Alright. I left the engines on. Kind of a little upset about that. Let's see. Repair tool. Where? There you are. Uh... Why? It's just the repair tool, right? Too close or something? What's going on here? Yeah, that's weird. That's not working. Anyone got any ideas? How are we powering my base? Like my one back home? It's just solar power. Just solar power. Huh. Yeah, that's not great. Not not super keen. Oh, let's see here. I'm gonna turn this bad boy around. Anyone have any ideas of why I cannot heal the machine? Asking for friend. Switch the battery? Would that fix it? Yeah, I'll turn off the battery as well, right? Before I forget. Okay. Turn it off, turn it on again? Yeah, right. I'm trying to ease its pain, but it won't let me. It says repair. I do this, nothing happens. Okay. What if we say, like chat says, nope, that didn't do it either. All right, here's an idea. We're gonna save. I'm gonna quit. Jump back in. Passing 100 meters. Oxygen efficiency decreased. Passing 200 meters. Oxygen efficiency greatly decreased. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I have the rebreather on. Okay. Um. So the damage is now missing. And over here now. Okay. Not sure what that was about. But it's fine. That is less fine. And it's probably going to be a slight problem later. Where's the damage? Top. We're doing top now. Okay. Yeah, see? Turn it off, turn it on again. Exactly. Alright, well here's hoping that that alien is willing to kind of let bygones be bygones and just kind of chill for a bit. There we go. Oh good, the music started. All right, she's topsy-turvy. We're all set. Now then, what's the prawn's depth? Anyone know? 900? The problem, the only problem I can see with this right now is that we are hovering above a pretty high pit. If I launch the prawn now, we'll never be able to get back in the fucking moon pool. So we're gonna have to figure something out here. Also, we don't have the Spider-Man, so it's just a bad idea all around. Let's just get to exploring. Let's see how bad an idea this is. It's gonna be fine. It's gonna be fine. Chat wants me to explore this area. We're going to explore this area. A nearby opening, leading to a biome with extensive fossilized remains. Great. Uh, no, not that. <laughs> mm -hmm. Okay. Guess we just start scanning things. Oh, 
Lost River, huh? I don't think I could stun that. We should go. We should go. That was a little big. What are you? Special required. Damn. Unless... There's some tiny pieces. Hi, spider. Don't mind me. Just out here collecting. This is the deep. Yeah. Collect a few of these. Good enough. Fuck are you. Ow! Where'd you go? There you are. Okay. Bit of uranium, because why the hell not? And let's get the hell out of here. Let's get out of Big Spook Land. Uh, yeah, that's good enough. What's this? A ruby? We're doing an oxygen. We're doing fine on oxygen. Everything's fine. Everything's dandy. Hmm. Okay. Kakiro! This place reminds you of the soundbite going, we're all gonna be safe and we're gonna have a great time. What in the Jesus Christ was that? <laughs> yep. Feels right. Well then. So this is a bit dangerous. Depth module, definitely important. I don't have one, but how do I build one? Because I know we picked it up. Mark two, mark three. We need that nickel. Chat, where's the nickel? We need nickel. I have not seen anything for that. Just yet. It's in that cavern? Really? They expect you to go down there without it? Hmm, that doesn't make any sense. How, oh, you would take the prawn. But the prawn requires a thing that I can't make. God! It's... All right, well. Well, such as it is. Oh, I see. Little boy. Okay. Yeah, I don't know about this, guys. <laughs> this might be too much. The, uh, the enemies here are making some really weird, sketchy noises, and I'm not super keen. Spending too much time here. Nickel. Nickel for your thoughts. Some of those gel pods. We'll take those. Ow. Ah, oh, making creepy ass noises. Chad, I feel like you've misled me here. In the green pools. Oh. That's magnetite. Okay. Ah. Ooh, yep, don't do that. Okay, got it. Do we note it? Yeah, 
Like, Chad, this is magnetite. This is not nickel. Unless that's what these are. Oh, that's silver. Protism green. Well, that's good. Silver again. <gasps> Something new. We're a little low on oxygen. Start heading back. Yeah, just dip my hand in there. <laughs> Interesting. So there is actually, in fact, a river down here. Technically, that's lead. You remember nickel being further than this? Yeah, I have a feeling that is, in fact, the case. I have a feeling that is the truth. You should go deeper. Uh, not right now. Do, 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 Probably need the prawn arm. Yeah, I think so. Ah, <sighs> okay. Well, now we know. Bring enough stuff to build a base. Yeah, that's, that's an idea, too. That is an idea, too. Well, we tried. We got some things. Base prawn would be fine. Okay, that's good to know. I think what I'd like to do is I'd like to get the grappling hook. That way we can get back to the submarine. I would really like to get the depth modifier, but clearly we need to use the prawn to do all that. Where's my base that way? Yeah, so it's going to be a whole thing. I will look into it. I will do a little research. We'll figure out what it's... What exactly we need and don't need. But, uh, yeah, that's for another time. I'm going to get us back to base and then we will... Call it good. Excessive noise. Oh, what is that? I never saw that. The head is down. Interesting. I don't think I've ever been in there. Hmm. Well, I mean, we gotta check it out. We gotta check it out. Okay. Let's see. How do we get in here? How do we get in here? Sonar worries Reggie. Well, that's good. <laughs> oh, well, that's good. I'll keep that in mind. I did not recharge my other air kit. Let's not make that mistake. Can't believe this game is 10 years old. Is it in fact 10 years old? Wow. It aged gracefully. Step one, use lasers. <laughs> Step four, exhaust other options. Well, we have lasers. We have lasers. I just need to find a door to use them to get into. I want to get in there. How do I get in there? So this poor sea glide is running low on battery. That might be a problem later. Hmm. 
Oh, hold on. I'm seeing doorways. Aha! That's gonna be a mess to get into later. Thermal reactor module. Okay, that would be the energy thing you guys were talking about. Cool, cool. The way I see it, no one's to blame here. He gave me the wrong coordinates. She didn't give me clear instruction. Okay, I'll rephrase. You've been equally incompetent. Now, we've lost time, but we're closer to the planet. So if the Degasi's out there, the scan should pick it up. Why are we even helping the Mongolians? They're the competition. Enjoy your shore leave on Sanjay Station. Like having fuel in the tanks? Thank the Mongolians. We run the scans, we show them we didn't find anything, and we say thanks for the free dinner. Clear? Sir, there's something odd on the surface scan here. Turn that recorder off. <laughs> well. Hmm. Okay, so there's lots of ways to get in. They just all go to nowhere? Let's hope there'd be a little bit more. I was hoping there'd be a little bit more here, but... Apparently there is not. Oh, I mean, we we gotta get the plant shelf. Okay. Ah, hold on a minute. Not repair. Laser cutter. Okay. This takes forever. Okay, let's see. What do we got going on here? Nothing in this module. Light stick fragment. If that's something I need or not, we'll take it. Whatever. Cyclops hole fragment. We definitely don't need that. Hey! Did need that though. You'd love to see it. Just take these for the titanium. Love to see it. And we already went through all that. Is this door open? Service says no. Time to leave. Uh, duh, duh. How do we leave? Let's see. Through the door. There we go. There we go. Okay. Awesome. Oh, he drowned. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. We got plenty of air. I came prepared. Yes, yeah, so we got the upgrade. We got the thermal. Perfect. Time to go home. Yeah. I hit flag. Emergency speed. Vessel counterfeit. Excessive noise. <laughs> Morning, engine, open standard. All right. Be cool to find the drill arm too. Would be cool. We'll uh, probably not get that one anytime soon, but if it pops up, we'll do it. No, I'm mostly concerned about getting the grappling. Which is great. Try using low cameras when driving. Can you use the cameras while you're driving? Oh, I didn't realize you could do this while driving. Um. Oh. Interesting. That makes a bit more sense. Hmm. Well, I've gotten so used to this now. <laughs> That's okay. Good to know, though. The drill and I think most other arms are in a wreck behind the first alien base where the sunbeam was shot down. Oh, sure, yeah. Mm -hmm. 
Helps with not scraping the bottom. We never scrape the bottom. We're just beating the game. We're just beating the game, Biochronica. How far away? Not very. We're pulling it into the parking garage. Here's good enough. Okay. Engine powering down. All right, we're getting the hang of this. Look at that. Looking great. Which of my energy cells are running a little low? You. And you. Prawn is doing fine. Um, okay. Head to the base. We got charged with the batteries a little bit. Welcome this power is rocking. Do that. Oh, my batteries are a little low. Let's see. Power cells. Battery. Right, get those going. Power cell charger. Got a lot to put away here. Um, there we go. Should drain our power pretty quickly. Let's see. Other than that, though. Okay, that's cool, I guess. Prawn. Prawn requires... Oh, look at all this new shit. <laughs> oh, boy. Jumpsuit jet upgrade. Oh, fuck. That would be cool. But we just want this thing, which I have all the pieces for. Um, more importantly, though, where is... that before. Um, upgrade, upgrade, upgrade. Where are you at? If you click the console, there we go. Oh, naturally it's going to require things that require silver. All right. Hmm. Interesting. Anywho. All right. I think that's good enough for me for today. Um, we, yoink. I'm going to write some notes for myself here. So we made the Cyclops, we went to the signals. We did all that, so that's cool. Um, but notes for next stream are going to include... <laughs> we need to... Oh, yeah, we'll check the cuttlefish. Good call, good call. We'll do that right before we leave. Um, put batteries back into Cyclops. So we don't forget that. Collect charging batteries. So we don't forget that. Make vehicle upgrade station. Um, upgrade prawn into Spider Man. What else? What else are we supposed to do here? Would I ever be interested in Koi Pond? IRL? Maybe. In game? No. Jump jets is really useful, makes you jump longer. Would be great. Can't make right now. Um, and then re-explore. Which which uh, which beacon was it that we went to? Is it this one? Life pod two. No. Well, technically yes. Okay. So I'm gonna say re-explore. Life Pod 2 slash Lost River with Prawn. Get Nickel back. 
Okay. All right. I think that's about it. Let's go look at the cuttlefish, and then that's it for today. Warning. Emergency power only. Oxygen production offline. What? Why is this? Okay. Where's it? Oh. You guys wanted me to spawn that thing? That thing's horrifying. Why would we... <laughs> Why did you want me to take this? Can I touch it? I can pick it up. Okay. Somebody said put it outside, so let's try that, I guess? Oh, it's a baby. Oh, good. So this gets bigger. Great. No, that's fine. <laughs> Look at this thing. All right. Oh, you can play with it. Wait, hold on. Hello. It follows me? I saw a command to stop following. Interesting. Huh. Okay. Well, don't follow me. Go do something else. Go be cute. All right. Well, that's the thing. Cool. And like I said, that's enough for today. Made some heavy progress. We built a yellow submarine, which is pretty cool. Oxygen production offline. Yeah, we made a giant submarine. We got everything kind of rolling. It's been a pretty good, uh, pretty good session. I think we're almost there. Scan him. All right, all right, all right. Where's he at? There's the little bugger. There he is. Hey, you. Cuttlefish. Emotional connection between living creatures with an essential component. <laughs> Only purpose, emotional health. Okay. Cool. Has the HP of a reaper so you don't have to worry about it getting eaten? Fantastic. All right. Well, like I said, chat, that's about it for me today. Uh, thanks for stopping by. Thanks for keeping me entertained and company while I am diving into the depths. Remember to keep calm. And other than that, everybody, take care of yourselves. Be good to one another. See you all again soon. Bye-bye.